yo what's up youtube we're not gonna waste any time going into this one because this one's gonna be a real banger so in this video we're gonna talk about how to get better at roblox bed wars pvp so this is a topic i've really been wanting to get into i've always been saying how to make this video but i've been delaying it so here you guys go so the first and most important thing if you ask me about roblox pvp for bed wars is knowing how to strafe that may be one of if not the best tip i can really give you and instead of like other videos i'm going to show you guys actual examples of me doing it so yeah i'm going to put up screen on how i usually strafe when i'm in a fight so if you look at the clip on the screen you guys will notice how i strafe left and right to kill my opponent when you strafe left and right it's going to make you a harder target to hit and possibly make you able to combo somebody and also notice each time i strafe i hit my opponent never stop clicking when you're fighting somebody the second you stop is the second they have a chance to start a combo on you and you do not want that to happen if anything you want to start the combo on them so if you just keep spamming your click button while you're fighting and strafing at the same time you'll most likely initiate a combo a really quick tip before i want to get more into how to actually do the pvp part make sure your loot is good you always at all times have to have better equipment than the person you're going to fight because say someone has a diamond sword that's sharp, sharpness three you're obviously going to lose if you have a stone sword S same thing with armor make sure your armor is better than his if you have normal armor the brown armor and he has iron armor he's most likely going to win because his armor is better he has more health so just kind of take those things into consideration when you're about to approach a fight or if a fight is about to approach you so really just keep an eye out on who has what and how strong they are and yeah that's really what i do before i go into fights once you already have the first hit on somebody you most likely won the battle just for the fact that if you hit them and you started the combo all you have to do is sprint and tap w as you hit and it furthers your knockback so if you just do that your knockback will go up tremendously than what it would if you didn't tap w at all and you just held w or you just strafed so what i usually do is i strafe tap w sprint and hit if you do all those together you can combo like deadly it's insane on how many kills confirmed kills i've gotten off of that and also i have no clue if this works or not but lately i've been jumping to start my combos and it's been letting me get the hit off first usually most of the time so like i'd be in a fight and then i jump and then i'd get my head off and i can start initiating the combo and then the combo ends up working in the long run so just try jumping it might not it might work it might not who knows but i just thought i'd throw that in there also in my opinion a good way to practice is to make a custom match and go in there with your friend and both of you just practice co doing combos with each other uh, I did that for a while and it actually kind of helped so just make a custom match and invite some of your friends and you guys can just practice comboing each other it should help you in the long run and it'll help you become a better bed wars pvp -er and player overall also another tip i'll give for somebody is to buy a lot of ender pearls if you can get in a fight and you know you're about to lose you could just hurry up and ender pearl away especially if you're in a clutch life where you have no bed and if you die you're back to the lobby so therefore i usually just go to the middle grab two emeralds go back to my base and get at least one ender pearl if so can save me in a pvp situation if i need to or i can use it as a situation to rush someone they wouldn't expect you to hurry up and teleport onto their base break their bed and then kill them so yeah that's why i say you should uh invest into ender pearls when you have enough emeralds also another important thing is cps what cps is is your clicks per second and a game like bed wars it matters on how fast you can click basically how fast you can swing your sword and in my how to build faster video i showed a little quick tip on how to build faster and one of the click styles were called butterfly clicks it works the same thing for pvp if you just use a butterfly click then it'll make life a lot easier because it essentially doubles your cps i'll put a, a example on the screen of what butterfly clicking looks like it's quite easy to do and it takes a little bit of time to learn but once you learn it you won't regret it so that's gonna be all the tips for this one hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you guys all later peace